Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. Today I'll be doing a line of sight flight with the Beast X here. Um, except I will be doing it with some recorded GoPro footage because a lot of you guys have been asking for HD line of sight on board what the kind of that footage would look like. And I do apologize for my voice. I'm pretty sick right now, so I'll try and talk as little as possible. Um, I've got the Brother Hobby, Brother Hobby Tornado T2, 2206, 2300 kV motors, DAL Cyclone V2, the T5046 version on here. I put some yellow on just so you guys can see it better and actually looks surprisingly good on here. I've got some DYS XSD 20 amp ESCs running D-Shot 600, X Racer F303 version 3.1. Running Beta Flight 3.1.6 stock PIDs, um, I believe 8K there. XSR receiver, my Tyrannus, just a Rotor Riot Edition HS1177, and the GoPro Session 5. In there. So let's get ready. Welcome to OpenTX. I actually think I've only ever flown a line of sight flight with a, the GoPro or an HD camera on one other time. <laughs> that was a long time ago. Because there's just no point because you're siding weight. So let's see, everything looks good. Well, let's just start up here. Alright. It's pretty windy out right now, so hopefully the wind buffing's not too bad. Creeping around. Yeah, I can definitely feel the weight. hear any uh, oscillations, I do need to uh, soft mount this flight controller. I'm um, getting some vibrations through the steel bolt. Just have not got around to doing that yet, but it's fine enough to fly on a sight. Man, this guy is loud. Oh, I forgot to say my battery. That's a uh, 4S Graphene Turnigy, uh 1300 milliamp hour 65C version. And all up weight, I believe, is just over 600 grams on this guy. Power loops there. Nine, Whoa, battery getting pretty seven, low. Alright, let's just finish up with that. A little hand catch there and shut off my timer. So there we go, that was a line of sight flight with onboard GoPro footage. Um, not sure why you guys want it. It's probably going to look really weird because you're not, you know, you're making things look good for the line of sight camera, not the FPV camera. But a lot of you guys asked for it, so there it was. Hopefully you enjoyed. Please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.